are in the Medieval Color Legacy Challenge neighborhood today. You can see some changes have happened, namely everybody's a teenager. That's because for this challenge it doesn't really matter aging-wise what happens, and we need our voted heir, Veronique, who is currently getting a nookie and probably deserves it, to start getting badges. So I aged up everybody to teenagers so they could also help. And you'll see Adelaide is gone because there was just there was too many people. Too many people. Adelaide is off living her best life. We wish her luck. But the Blonde Brigade is here. The only other thing that really happened is Sebastian got a promotion, but he's got a long way to go and he needs a cruising point. So that's what he's going to do while we go run the business. I guess I don't have to make him do it right this second. Ollie, come on. You know what time it is. It's business time. So we are going to leave Dominique at home because I've discovered that she's not very useful because she's grumpy. So we're just going to leave her here. We're going to leave her here with Dad. She can go pick up pick poop or something. I don't know. She can do whatever she wants. But we will bring uh, Veronique for sure. And then probably Frederick. Everybody give, give no geese, it's fine. We'll see you later, Sebastian. It's kind of funny, playing ahead reminds me of the Brown Generation, because that's what I did with Brown Generation. I would play the week because all I was doing was farming and it didn't really matter. And so it's kind of, we're touching back to our roots. Also, I don't have a soda. What is this crime? I do have a soda. that I am hydrated. And by hydrated, I mean probably losing hydration. But listen, it's sugar-free. That is as far as I'm willing to go. Everyone in my life is like, you should stop drinking soda. I'm like, I probably should, but I'm not going to. I'm allowed to have one vice in this world, and that vice is drinking soda. Yeah, you can see, I built a wall. I actually had to trap Dominique in there because she was just refusing to be helpful. I don't think we have any truffles. That's fine. You want a sales badge, so we're gonna try to have you do sales. Isidore, you're gonna restock. Holly, fill these in. Wonderful. You're gonna go build a snowman. That's a choice. I at least want her to get one bronze badge. I would left I would have left all the kids and only had the two, but I have to bring Holly because she has all the inventory and we're at rank five. I think that also happened while you guys were gone, but yeah, we can't afford to just have two Sims running the business. Alright, go help him. Come on, girly. Come on, you might be evil, but this is your way to the top. And he didn't like it. What about Brandon Lillard? Eh? Ooh, he didn't like that either. All right. Go hunt for bugs for a minute. Holly, go dazzle him. Dazzle him while you're at it. Oh wait, I think... You can help him! Can't I just choose to recap? Because I don't want her to do other things and be annoying. Ronique, go and help him. There is a bug I've noticed where like Sims will come and they'll just be like absolutely miserable for no reason. So I have been bumping their motives because it's rude. 
It's rude behavior. Okay, go show him the thing. He got a little lost, but it's okay. All right, Holly. Go bird watch. All right, let's try selling to Icel again. Are you not restocking? Because there's two things here, bugaboo. He is not in your way, girl. Basic sell. There you go. Just one, because he might not like it. He's been a little rude. He didn't like Holly, so. Oh no, look, now he's in a better mood. See, that's what I mean, like they, they come in a bad mood and they ruin everything. And that's not very fair. If he'd been here for hours and hours and hours, it's different, but he just got here. Mickey Cormier, notice everybody has the spirit today. Everybody is dressed appropriately. We just helped you. I sell, I swear, if you make us lose a star, I'm gonna be mad at you. You're never getting married in at this rate. Maybe this is his revenge for not getting chosen. Uh, up, 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 up. Come on, girly. You can do it. I don't know why she started with sales badge. That's like one of the harder ones to get. But that's what she wanted. And I'm not playing really to once in this challenge, but it does. She, she needs one anyways, so. We'll help her out. Holly, what are you doing? Don't disrupt the customers. Gotta make sure she's kept busy. might have her dazzle a cell just to keep him happy. Oh, whoops. Things are going good. forgot to generate piglets. So they have four sows. Where's my dice? We'll just pretend we generated these the normal way through the sows, but. Okay, so we get one. Sow number two. Three. Sow number four. Five. out what I'm going to do for her spouse, because now that we've chosen, okay, A, is she straight or, oh, 
Oh, she hasn't chosen yet. We'll randomize her. Come on, bronze badge. Her bronze fence. Now she needs to restock. Which means Isidore, you are off the hook. Go stargaze. Mom's back on sales. and now he's like trying to run a register and failing miserably. Hey, Lankin, you better not be here to cause trouble. I will say she's the easiest sim to keep happy because she just wants the business to be successful. We love that for her. What are you doing? Are you dealing with Lankin, who is a jerk a lot of the time? Oh. Is a door. We stock that. Oh. Throw my dice back out of the way. She says, ta da! Alright, Brandy Letourneau. Good job, Frederick. Nobody quit. I'm very proud of you. I don't know if we're going to be able to get this batch. I might be pushing it. She's not doing too well in school, but like, she doesn't need to. him. That's not what we want him to do. We want to dazzle him. Once we're out of piglets, we'll head back home. being hateful to you, but like, stop it. I would love if we were rank six. That would really, really please me. It would be ideal. Look at you, Lankin. You're not being a problem today. Typically, you're a problem for our family. Instead, Jan is being a problem. Everybody in this generation is basically blonde, except for Sebastian. We might need to introduce some new hair colors. But yeah, I don't know what to do about the spouse situation now. Because part of me wants to do like an arranged marriage sort of thing. Another part of me just wants to make a sim and have meat. I 
could download other people's sims and have that be the spouse or that she could just meet whoever she has the most chemistry with like I don't know because they're like in a weird situation where like they're running businesses and this is the last business they're ever going to run because they're moving up the ranks but do I take moving up the ranks to mean there's no more love matches or because Holly was kind of a love match with Sebastian kind of I think I feel like the one bad side about doing group motives is it's a little cheaty because they can run the business a lot longer but yeah We've been having so many business problems that I'm taking it. I'm allowed to have this. Frederick, you were taking forever to get this badge, by the way, buddy. Just ages to get any kind of badge. Your sister already has one. Okay, we're out. We're out. We're out. Time to go home. We are out of pigs for the day. Everybody leave. And jump rope, apparently. I love that they tap their wrists like ta 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 day. Oh wait, someone needs to bring up the customers. Frederick, no, you need to bring up these customers. Bring up the customers. Shoot. Not bad. We got a bronze badge, which is needed. She needs two more. Which I think cash register is going to be the hardest, judging by how long it's taken Frederick, and he still doesn't have a badge. And he's been the cashier every time I've been to the lot, which is twice now. That's okay. That's okay. We'll get the badges that we need. Sebastian just needs to work on getting promoted. Because I'm having him reach level 10 of the business career rather than having a second business because of the mentioned business issues we've been having. And yeah, he's got a ways to go. So let's get them a mirror because they don't, oh yeah, they do. It's right there, it's right there, it's right there. So go practice speech. Dominique, I can't tell you to do anything, so I'm not gonna bother. She's a family sim, but she's like the crankiest. She's a loner. <laughs> And she's grumpy. So, like, you can't tell her anything. Very literally. She just cannot be bothered. Also, her dress is more red than pink, but I ran out of pink. Ran out of pink clothes. Pink is not common in my downloads folder, apparently. Why don't you go take a bath? Do Isidore's homework. You're in a good enough mood. Emmeline, that's very sad, but I'm not worried about it right now. I'm worried about this man getting a charisma point. Come on. You can do it. to do anything. So I will not bother. How about you go meet this new human? You want to meet a new person? Quickly before he leaves. See? See? You missed out. That's on you. Do, 
Yeah, she really did not win the trade lottery. That's why she was never an option for heir. I was just, there was no way I was gonna have a grumpy loner sim be my heir. Cause it's impossible. It's hard. She doesn't want to do nothing. Penguin! Hi, Penguin! Hi, friends! I didn't build you a snowman and I have no fish. I'm sorry. I, I was not expecting you. Ah! Oh, for goodness sake. Put them walls down! Can you go say hi to the penguin? Will you go say hi to the penguin? Should probably shoot the penguin. Knowing her. She looks just like Adelaide. Like her and Isidore and Adelaide could be triplets. So I kind of want to pet this penguin. Just pet the penguin. Experience joy for the first time in your miserable life. Don't think about eating the penguin. I made her pet a penguin and she's angry about it. Doop. Just for posterity's sake. But yeah, she could be a triplet to her sisters, for sure. Instead of a twin. Is she a twin? She is a twin. She's a twin to Frederick, that's right. Wait, there's a person. There's a person. You want to meet a person. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Come on, demonic. I mean, Dominique. I started calling her demonic in my head because she's a little difficult. See, you took forever and now the person's not there. Also, I told you to go to bed, buddy. Like, you want to meet people, but then you just drag your feet. So I'm just going to make you sit. Someone will walk by. Probably no one you're going to want to flirt with, but someone will walk by. There's somebody. Go greet Ethan Barrett. Quick, before he leaves. There you go. Does that make you... You met somebody new. You don't know him. Okay, thank you. How about you talk to him? Be friendly. As you can tell, I really don't know what to do with her because she's just so cranky all the time. She's not useful in the business. She's kind of not useful at home. I'm just counting the days till I can kick her out. Because it feels a little cheaty to kick her out now. I did kick out Adelaide, but... We'll keep her as long as we keep Frederick. I'm just kind of waiting for the family members to get home. But I can't remember what time. She's talking about growing up. She's like, listen, I grew up so badly. I have another fear slot. True, true. To be honest, I accidentally grew her up. I didn't mean to, but I queued it up twice. And so then I had to grow up Frederick, obviously. And so I didn't mean to have them all be teenagers, but it happened. It happened, and now we've got four blonde teenagers. Come on, everybody. Are you going to be home? She's having a terrible conversation, that's for sure. She's just, look at her. She's just so angry all the time. I think we're gonna go ahead and cut it here because I don't remember when everybody's gonna come back. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please do give it a like and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>